Hey guys, so, well today it is Sunday, April 10th, 2016. So time for a new lawn cutting video. So this is a lawn cutting video for the month of April. So as a request for the equipments, uh, we're going to use the Echo SRM225 blow with the Echo PB500T backpack blower and we'll mow with the Lawn Boy 10606 and so without further ado let's get started I might have to cut this lawn cutting video short but it's sunny right now but we do got some rain coming this way so I want to try and get this done as quickly as I can. So there's a possibility this might have to be a short lawn cutting video. Alright, so here is the trimmer. So this is my 2010 Echo SRM225 that I've had for six years. Definitely a good trimmer. Uh, this is Echo's uh, base model uh, straight shaft trimmer. It has a 21.2 cc engine it's also equipped with the I-30 recoil starter, which requires 30% less effort to start it. So let's see how it starts. It hasn't been started in about a month and a half, so we'll see how it starts. I'm going to just try and start it up like this. Show you how easy pulling it is. Alright, cool. Now I'll get y'all up on the tripod and we'll start trimming. All right, so the trimming is all done. All right, 
So once again, this is my 2010 SRM 225 straight shaft trimmer with a 21.2 cc engine. Alright, so now for the cutting portion here. And we'll start cutting here with the Lawn Boy 10606 here. If I can try to get this adapter unplugged with one hand here. Alright, hold on one second. Alright, so Lawn Boy 10606, serial number 311-004795. So 311 means that this mower is a 2011 model. All right. So back in 2011, this was Lawn Boy's top of the line uh, lawn mower. Uh, their top of the line residential model. Self-propelled with electric start. This has the Kohler Courage XT6 engine. It's an overhead valve, as you see right there. It says right there, six foot, 6.5 foot-pounds of gross torque, powered by Kohler, 149 cc's with smart choke. All right, it's starting to get cloudy now, so I need to get this done. Oh, come on, please start. There we go.
All right, so the front's all done, and now we'll do the back. good got the grass all done just as the clouds are starting to get dark starting to make it dark out here so that's good my dad just went and picked up some fertilizer so that way next month I can uh, fertilize so I think I'm gonna use this one first this one right here is the 10-1-1. We normally get the uh, the 922, but uh, they had this one on sale, so got it instead. And then this one here, we get it all the time as well. And I'll probably apply it in the fall time. So in the meantime, I'll uh, put these away, and then I'll start fertilizing next month once the grass starts to fully grow. My dad really wanted me to do the fertilizing today, but I was like, it's a little too early. I want to wait until the grass is all fully grown and then start uh, applying it, which I find that in the summertime we seem to get a better lawn that way. If I fertilize like in late spring rather than do it uh, in like early spring. All right, so grass is all done. Now we'll do the blowing with the Echo PB500T. All right, so before we begin the blowing, as you can actually see, I got the hummingbird feeders out. I had to actually cut a hole on the 
on the screen right here that we have right up on the shutters. I'm sorry, the gutters. Well, I don't know why I'm thinking shutters. Yeah, because we got little screens on there to prevent debris and stuff from getting in. I had to cut a hole so I can slip my hook in in order to get the hummingbird feeders up. So I just hung them up yesterday. So far there hadn't been any birds yet. It'll probably take a little while. It'll probably take maybe a, a couple weeks before they come. Alright, so what we got here is a Echo PB500T backpack floor. This has the 50.8cc engine. You can see all that. So let's see how this starts. Turn it on, choke, give it about five primes. Okay, this thing probably hadn't been started in maybe a month and a half as well. There we go. I didn't quite have the choke uh, all the way closed. That's probably why it took a lot of more pulls. Alright, cool. So I got it all done. And it hasn't rained yet. Which is actually good. So that's the lawn cutting video for the month of April. Featuring the 2011 Echo PB500T. The 2011 Lawn Boy 10606. And the 2010 Echo SRM225. Looks like the person from right down down the block over there. Yep, getting his grass cut. Try to beat Mother Nature. Alright, so 
that's it for the lawn cutting video. We need to get all this equipment put away just before it starts raining. And it looks like it's about to come. Alright, so thanks for watching.